So they're a little bit different. They're not EcoLogo certified, as most equipment is not EcoLogo certified. That is a UL standard that's generally um, related to chemicals. However, they do have a CRI certification, which is the Carpet and Rug Institute certifications, to be able to ensure that you've got um, different levels of volume. So you want to make sure that you've got low decibels. That's really important from an environmental perspective because noise is also part of, of what's impacting someone's work environment. So they look at that. They look at um, air quality control, making sure that there's no dust coming out of those vacuums. So the targets are slightly different than the, the DD3. The DD3 is a smaller canister vac really designed uh, for that everyday application where a target is a little bit more rugged. We've got it in both wet and dry. Most of the series is a wet dry vac. And then we've got our smaller 330 that is dry only, but they're really designed to be that canister vac that's gonna work for the long term. So if you think about it, we've got 10 year warranty on the body. And if I was to kick that across the room, it wouldn't, it wouldn't dent, there would be no problems. Beautiful part of it is the shepherd casters, don't allow it to tip over. It's just an all around great quality product. I laughed, I was at home the other day and I was looking at my vacuum inventory because you know it's normal that most people have vacuum inventory in their home. But I said, like, well, this is kind of silly. I have a fast track backpack for my stairs. I have a tracker upright back for my hallways and my carpets and hardwood. Then I bought my son a DB3, so he's got that for his apartment. I've got a, tra I've got a target out in the garage that we use. Who needs to have that many vacuums? Apparently it's just me, but we've got a whole host of vacuums at Destiny to meet every need, and apparently I feel like I need to have all of them at home. <laughs> They're fun. They are, they are. No one can complain that they don't have a vacuum. <laughs> exactly. Nobody complained that there's never nothing to do when there's that many vacuum options around. 